so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi! And today we're at the Bellevue, Washington Fire Station. And today we're gonna learn about fire trucks, ambulances, and the fire station. Look at what it is. This is a big red fire truck. Whoa, come check it out. Ooh. Wow, look at all these gauges. Huh, so interesting. Hey, look! It's a compartment with a lot of cool things in it. All right, let's go look at the fire station. Come on. Whoa. <laughs> all right, check out in here. So, it's really important for firefighters to stay nice and fit. Like over here, these weights. Uh, 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 these are bicep curls, and they make your arms nice and strong. It's really important for firefighters to stay in shape, because when they go in houses that are burning, they might need to carry someone down the stairs or up the stairs, and then down the ladder. <laughs> oh, hey, look! Whoa, medicine balls. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love exercising. Hey, some jump ropes. Have you ever jumped rope before? Check this out. See, every time I jump, the rope goes underneath my feet one time. And now, I'm gonna make it go, oh, <laughs> I messed up. I'm gonna make it go under my feet two times every time. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> Woo, that's tiring. <sighs> Being physically fit is really fun. All right, this is a treadmill. It's where you can walk and then be in one place. See? And you can also run. Whoa, here I go. Oh, it's getting faster and faster. Whoa. Now I just went really fast. All right, hit the tunes. <sighs> That's fun. Oh, hey, pull-ups. Woo! Now, last but not least, the bench press. This is a great way to keep your upper body nice and fit. So then, like I said, firefighters can help people and they're nice and strong. Yeah! All right, now let me show you the rest of the fire station. Come on. Woo! Check this out. Whoa. <laughs> so, not only do firefighters eat healthy and exercise at the fire stations, they also have to sleep because firefighters are here day and night. And just like you and I, firefighters need to sleep. And the reason why firefighters have a bed at the fire station is because they need to be really close to the fire trucks and ambulances just in case if there's an emergency. So, nighty night. Oh, wait a second. No time for sleeping now. I want to show you an ambulance. Let's go. Ooh, look at what it is. It's a medic unit, also known as an ambulance. Let's go check it out, come on. Let's look inside the cab. Whoa, now 
now we're inside the ambulance. All right, let's shut the door. First things first, safety first. Let's put on our seatbelt. All right, here it is. <laughs> All right, now we're ready. Whoa, what's this? It looks like a giant map. Whoa, you can use this so then you can see where you're gonna go. Um, right there. <laughs> All right. Oh, a computer? Whoa. This tells you where you're gonna go, like the address, the information, all about the call that you're doing. Oh, hey, look, a steering wheel. <laughs> that was the horn. Hey, move. We're going to help some people. Whoa. Whoa. What are these? These are headsets. Listen. Hello, hello. It's Medic Flippy. Do you need help? All right. We're going to come help you. <laughs> That's awesome. Whoa. Check this out down here. The siren. Listen. <laughs> hear that and you're in a vehicle or on the sidewalk get to the side because the ambulance is going to help someone all right and this right here turns on all of the lights go check them out oh the lights are so bright oh check out this compartment I wonder what's inside. Oh, hey. <laughs> this right here is a heart rate monitor. It gives all the medics the information about your heart. And this, this, yeah, is a medical unit pack. Whoa, there's so many interesting things in here. Whoa, hey, like a stethoscope. hear my heartbeat. Wow, that is so interesting. All right, let's lock this back up and go check out what else is around here. Ooh, whoa, another compartment. This is where all the firefighter gear is. See, here's some jackets. Oh, hey, and here's even a helmet that they wear when they go into areas with fires. Hey, do you know another time that you should wear a helmet? when you ride a bicycle. <laughs> All right. Oh, the back of the ambulance. Oh, get ready. Whoa. Look at this. This is the stretcher. Watch out, here it comes. This is what you might get a lay on sometime. And if you do, just be very calm. The people are trying to help you. All right, let's leave this right here. <laughs> All right. Oh, let's go inside the back of the ambulance. Let's go. Oh, here we are. This is another entrance. Come on. Whoa, it's so bright and light in here. Wow, very interesting. Oh, hey, look at what it is. It's another stethoscope. <laughs> Put it on my ears. Listen. Do you hear that? Yeah, that's my heart beating. I'm nice and healthy. <laughs> All right. Put that right there. What else is around here? Oh, hey, look. Rubber gloves. I'll put one of these on. Oh. All right, these keep my hands nice and clean. 
when I'm working in the back of the ambulance. Hey, what color is this? Yeah, it's the color blue. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, look at this. Ew. Do you see this? That's Mr. Yuck. If you ever see Mr. Yuck somewhere, do not eat it. Don't drink it, and we should probably stay away. <laughs> Let's look in another cupboard. Hey, like this one. Wow, that's interesting. A lot of medications and things to help people if you're in trouble. Hey, just know, if you ever need to ride in an ambulance, be careful, be nice and calm, because the people in here are just trying to help you. Well, let's go have some more fun. Whoa, what is that? That looks like a hospital on wheels. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's a little hospital on wheels. It's a vehicle that can transport people who are sick or hurt to the nearest hospital with a medical team that rides around always ready for people who need help it's now. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's a little hospital on it's wheels. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's a little hospital on wheels. You can call it up in emergencies. The siren turns on and it races to the scene. Some are yellow and green, some red, white, or blue. But they're all here to help me and you. So many neat things in an ambulance, like oxygen tanks and first aid kits. There's a stretcher in the back, the patient lays on, they've got and medicine and a siren on top that go when the siren turns on all the cars move it's out of the way it's an ambulance it's an ambulance it's an ambulance it's a little hospital on it's wheels. an ambulance it's an ambulance it's an ambulance it's a little hospital on wheels and remember boys and girls only call an ambulance in a real emergency. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's a little hospital on wheels. All right, now let me show you one of my favorite parts. <laughs> Come on. Ooh, yeah, this is the kitchen. And this is a fridge <laughs> with a lot of food in it. Here's another one. Wow. Firefighters work really long days and nights, and so they have to have a kitchen so they can eat and stay nice and healthy. Oh, hey, look, here's some food. Ooh, this looks tasty. We have some salad, a potato, we even have some chips. Ooh, and a strawberry. Yum. So what we're doing now is we're just getting ready for a training exercise. Yeah, we're doing really good. What's that? Yeah, I see lights. I hear a siren. That must mean that there's a fire. We gotta go help some people. Let's go, come on. Oh, do you hear that? That's the sirens and the lights. We need to get all of our fire equipment on. Okay. First, our pants and the boots. We need to take off our shoes. One shoe. Two shoes. All right, I need to hurry. All right, there we go. I've got my boots on. <laughs> All right, here we go. Take off my pants. Nice, nice and buckled. Put on my suspenders over my orange suspenders. All right, tight, tighten that up. Oh, all right, Ooh, my jacket. Mm -hmm. Put this on. All of this will keep me safe when I'm at the fire. All right, here we go. We need to zip it up. Ooh, here's the zipper. Put it in there like that. There we go. Velcro. Okay, uh, 
then we have the helmet. This will keep my head safe. Perfect. Tighten it up. And then last but not least, my two gloves. <laughs> All right. Man, I got ready really quick because I don't know what's happening there. All right, let's go. something else really cool to show you. First, I need to take off my helmet. Let's put that right up there. The next thing I have to do is put on a mask. This goes all around my head to keep my ear and my hair safe. <laughs> all right. Woo, all right, check out my sweet hood. <laughs> yeah, this is the color black. All right. The next piece of equipment I'm gonna put on is this mask. This mask is gonna help protect my eyes and then be able to deliver clean oxygen so I can breathe in the smoke. Are you ready? Ooh, look at me now. I have my mask on. Hey, if there's a firefighter trying to help you, they might look like this, but that's okay. They're not scary. They're just trying to help you. Okay, let me put on my helmet now. There we go. Now that it's nice and snug, <laughs> I'm gonna put on the air tank. Ooh, yeah. Look, it's an air tank. This is what provides air to me. Just like Now I can breathe when I'm going through a burning house. Do you hear that? So what that is, is air coming from the tank, going through the tube into my mouth. So then smoke doesn't come inside. All right, let's go check out some more of the fire station. Woo! All right, now let me show you some of the parts of the fire truck. Whoa, look at this. This is a really big wheel and tire. Whoa, it's silver and black. <laughs> okay, let me show you inside the fire truck. Check it out. Oh, that's 
that's really neat in there. They look like they're ready to go to a fire. <laughs> oh, look at this. Whoa, there are so many gauges. Oh, huh, interesting. There's so many, I don't even know what they're for. <laughs> Ooh, look at in here. Whoa, one compartment. Another compartment? And this compartment has fire extinguishers. Let's count them. One, two, three. Good job, come on. Interesting, more things. Like a little broom. It's nice and clean. Let's go to the back. Wait, where are you going? Come over here. Do you see those? There's so many different sizes of hoses. Oh, interesting. All right, what else do we have? Hey, here's a compartment. Whoa, look in there. Whee! This is a really big ladder. So then the firefighters can go up really high and save people off of roofs and windows. I'll lock it back up. There we go. Ooh, what's in here? Huh, hey. Yeah, a chainsaw. So much great equipment on a fire truck. Hey, another compartment. Hey, bolt cutters, an axe. Wow, even look. Yeah, even <laughs> a hammer. All right, I'm gonna set that right there. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. This is where you connect the fire hydrant to the fire truck. And let me show you. Have you ever wondered what this thing is at a fire station? Yeah. This is what connects to the fire engine's exhaust. So then, no smoke from the fire truck goes inside. Yeah. All right. That was awesome. Ooh. <laughs> that was so much fun learning about fire engines. Medic units, <laughs> ambulances, and the life of a firefighter at the fire station. Hey, it's really important to know what number to call if there's an emergency. So be sure to ask a grown up what number to call if there is an emergency, like a fire. Hey, it's also really important to have a working smoke detector and carbon monoxide detector. So then if there's ever a problem, it will chirp like this. Yeah, and then you can call the emergency number. So then you'll get some help. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Flippy, good job. See you soon, bye-bye! Look at what it is! It's an excavator! Yeah! Are you ready to learn about excavators with me? Yeah! Let's go!
are so spectacular! Let's look at the parts of the excavator. <laughs> Come here. Hmm. Let's start with the cab. This inside here is where the operator of the excavator sits. Look inside. Wow, there's a lot of controls in there. Ooh, that looks fun. <laughs> okay, let's close the door. Oh, whoa, look. Yeah, these are the tracks of the excavator. Wow, there's no wheels and tires on an excavator. There are only these tracks and it allows for it to go over rocks and mud and, and big piles of dirt and not even get stuck like this. <laughs> See, I didn't even get stuck. Woo, and look back here. This is the engine compartment. This is where the excavator gets all of its power from. Huh, look. Wow. There's more engine components on the other side and the top, but there's a bunch of radiators, coolant, and all that fun stuff in here. I almost forgot my favorite part, the bucket. Let's go. Whoa, look at the bucket. This excavator bucket is really big. It can grab and scoop a bunch of dirt out of the earth. And this part right here, the clamper, yeah, it's called the thumb. Whoa, and look at all of this. Wow, this is the arm of the excavator. It's really tall. And that part, that is the boom of the excavator. The arm and the boom and the bucket. And how all of this gets powered are these hydraulic cylinders. Wow. They push fluid up so then everything can move. Whoa, it's like I'm an excavator. That was so much fun learning the parts of an excavator. Now it's time to operate the excavator. Let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. First things first, safety first. Yeah, yeah. look, I got my safety vest on and my hard hat. <laughs> Joysticks? These are what operate the arm and the boom and the bucket. See? Oh, and this one, this one makes it swivel. Watch this. Whoa! 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 This is so much fun. Wee! Okay, and then I'll push it the other way. Now we're going to swivel around this way. Whoa! 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 
<laughs> Whee! Okay, here we go. All right, enough swiveling. Now it's time to dig. the joysticks yeah whoa look at how big this scoop is yeah hey now let's dump out the scoop whoa that was a big scoop <laughs> Excavator to find a new spot to dig in. Look at what it is! It's a stump! I wonder what's underneath the stump. where the stump used to be. I wonder what's underneath the stump. Looks like a bunch of dirt. A lot of dirt. And look, a giant rock. What else? Look, it's a boom box. Boom boxes play music. I wonder what song is in here. Excavator. It's the excavator song! Excavator. Hey dirt, see you later. I'm an excavator. I've got a great big arm and a great big boom. If I start digging now, I'll be done real soon. I'm a dirt separator. I'm an excavator. Excavator. I'll teach you. All you gotta do is bring up your arm, like it's the arm and the boom in the bucket, and start to scoop. <laughs> That's fun! Got a place where workers sit, it's called a cab Where they control the bucket to scoop and grab I'm a whole regulator, I'm an excavator Oh, can't you see that I work all day? Do you ever sleep? No time for sleep I'm an excavator, excavator, hey dirt, see you later, I'm an excavator, excavator, excavator. That was so much fun learning about 
about the marvelous machine of an excavator with you. Bye! <laughs> yeah! Hey, it's me, Blippi. I think we should draw something together. A big machine that puts out fires. And most of the time, it's the color red. Yeah, a fire truck. Let's draw this. All right, first there's gonna be a rectangle up front for the cab. Whoa, and then, whoa, a sideways rectangle. Yeah, and that's where all the tools are. We went up here. Yeah, we can draw another rectangle with a bunch of lines on it. Yeah, do you know what that is? Yeah, the ladder. And you can't forget about the wheels and tires. There we go. Oh, and a window for the cab. Oh, and then circle. A circle, a circle, a circle. Yeah, it looks like a spiral. And that is the hose and the sprayer. Yeah. Can't forget about the half circle up there for the siren. Wow, now that's a great looking fire truck. <laughs> if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Flippy. -P -P -I. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone, let's make learning fun. It'll make you wanna shout Whippy!